of Urban Goes Green. We have with us Ron and Marge from Box My Garden. They're a fantastic support to urban reforestation. Um, they've uh, actually donated a few of their wonderful boxes for us, us to have in the waterfront front garden. And uh, they are a Geelong family-based business uh, and have worked in many different locations. Where, where's one of your best, uh, what, what, what are your stories you've got for us? Uh, we, we do a lot of school work and um, we did some um, garden beds up in Sydney in a primary school which was really good on, on wheels and uh, three big boxes went up there and uh, they've just set it up, it's fantastic. Great, so it's not just uh, Victoria then you've been working in lots of different places and you custom make your planter boxes and we've got an example of a few here today. Um, this one's a very good starting point for people to look at if they're not very familiar with having their own planter box or where to start with a veggie garden. Uh, this one particularly is good with herbs and is a, a good little small size. And then Ron's going to tell you about the different um, sizes that are available. Thank you. Uh, th this little one here uh, is a herb garden. It's made from Australian cypress and uh, it's uh, very durable timber. The uh, screws are all stainless steel. And we also have this. Oh, we also make these on uh, wheels, so it's very handy to uh, push around the um, the decks, and it can move in and out. You know, if you get a really hot day, uh, you can just move it out of the sun. And they produce a lot of herbs. Our grandkids um, often go out to ours and pick off the leaves and smell them. So they they look at them, they smell them, and they eat them, which is really good for them. Uh, the next one here. This is just an example of our big. Uh, box that we make. This is a non-ground garden box and we can make these up to five metres long. They're exceptionally solid. Again, stainless steel fittings go into them and it has a seat around uh, which you can just sit down there and weed merrily away and I can assure you once you start using one of these in your garden you'll never go back to gardening off the ground again. They are just so convenient and so easy. So that's one of our big ones. Over here this is uh, another garden bed which is suitable for uh, patios. Uh, we have, again they're custom made, all different sizes. This one we're, we're starting to sell a lot with wheels so people could just move them around on their concrete or their bricks. And they're deeper than the herb garden so they're very suitable for growing all types of vegetables and stuff like that. Uh, carrots, lettuces and they really produce tomatoes. Uh, we put one into a house once and we got photos, I think it was about four weeks later and the plants had just gone completely berserk and uh, it was a really, good, um, a really good result for them, they were very, very happy. You can put pot plants in them or you can just plant them out with soil. Uh, they've got a mesh down on the bottom and you can put weed mat on the top of that and then if you like you can put Lilydale toppings which acts as a final filter and um, that... Uh, it works very efficiently. This one over here is uh, one of our latest that we're, we're doing. Uh, we've got a friend who does espaliers and he makes the stainless steel frames. These boxes are made especially for the frames. The frames just fit in. You can see they've got little um, grooves here and again you can just plant those out and uh, you, can, you can basically grow any, anything you like. There's lemon trees, orange, orange trees and you can have that out on your patio and they look great, they smell tremendous and you can also eat the produce off them. Um, and uh, I'll just take you over here and we'll have a look at this great new product. I think this will be a uh, very good idea for a lot of people who have those balconies and they have the ugly air conditioner and they don't know really what to do with it and they don't actually enjoy using that space because it does look quite ugly. So uh, Ron and Marge have come up with this fantastic design and it actually sits just neatly around your air conditioner and you can put your pots in the top there or you can actually make that a planter box and fill that with soil, grow yourself some herbs. You can just pop out, grab a few things while you're cooking and uh, that has been a very popular design I understand. Yes, it certainly has been and we didn't come up with the idea. There was a, uh, a young man uh, called us up and he said he wanted to get rid of his uh, air conditioner uh, so this is what we came up with. And again, they're all custom made. You don't have to have that many slats. Some people don't have any slats at all on the front. And we can just vary the size depending on the, um, the size of the unit. Mm. Okay, so if you'd like to have a look at the 
the full range of products available um, with Box My Garden. Their website is www.boxmygarden.com.au um, and as Ron has been telling everybody, uh, the planter boxes can be custom made and we do have an example of a few here at the shop at 71 Merchant Street in the Docklands um, and they are a fantastic way to start yourself off, give it a go, try a veggie patch, try some herbs and before you know it you'll have yourself a little garden. So thank you very much for coming today and it was fantastic to learn about all your wonderful products. Thank you very much for having us. Thank you.